Good morning guys, welcome to the vlog today. Uh, we are still here in Pittsburgh. This is our last day. We're actually getting ready to head to the Steel City Reptile Expo. Uh, Mark has a table out there, so we're going to meet up with him for a quick little bit and just a quick run through the show, see what they have out there. I'm told they have some awesome animals and some different things, so we're gonna check that out before we have to come back here and pack everything up and get back on the road because we are performing at that country club tonight. Uh, so we have a quick four hour trip back home and then on down to Glendale. All right guys, we have made it to the Steel City Expo show. We're gonna go meet up with my friend real quick. Uh, we're gonna check out lots of stuff. Oh man. This is an awesome show. They got tons of stuff here. They got all kinds of stuff. We're gonna go check things out, make sure you got some stuff. And we're gonna have a great time. There's Sean holding a. So that's a leucistic Texas rat snake, and look at those eyes. Try and get it. Come on. There we go. Okay. And so on. I mean, he's got to be close to adulthood, right? You know what he is? Yeah. Does he stay white like that all the time? Yep. Oh. Because it's we call it leucistic. That means it's in his genes, and he's lacking the dark pigment. Ah, oh, so it's so, like an albino? Well, not an albino. It's but... uh, like a, it's essentially like that. It's just but albino is lacking different pigment. So this is a locality, and you breed certain snakes, and you get snakes like I'm this. Trying to get his tongue. Make him go sideways, I can't see his tongue. You mean go sideways? Yeah. Oh gosh. Okay, oh, I saw it that time. And the tongue is how they smell, right? And taste. Yeah, smell, taste, yeah. Oh no. They have reptiles have what's... Well, I don't know. I don't know what the snakes do. <laughs> You see his eyes though? Yeah. Like uh, here we have a milk snake, guys. And you like just milk? remember, with some snakes, the, the whole tail of red touch black, you're okay, Jack. And red touch yellow, you're a dead fellow. Most of the time is right, but you can't always go by it. So just if you see if you see snakes in public, just just leave them alone. Don't touch them. Because the, this guy does look exactly like the coral snake, which is very dangerous, and there are ones that have bands. So if you see one, just call someone, let someone take care of it. Don't worry about removing it yourself. Most people get bit actually trying to kill these guys or shoot them away. So just leave them alone. As you can see, he doesn't want to hurt anybody. Look at that little face okay. there. There we go. Look at this guy here. We got a nice little American alligator. And what? A couple years? Yeah, about, yeah. I'd say three years. Three, three to four years yeah. old. You can hear him going to town. Look at that guy. Don't give me a hug. There you go, Ma. <laughs> You're just a fun little guy, aren't you, man? Look, look at the coloring on that. She's scared of the gator. Oh, yeah. Probably. She doesn't really like reptiles. <laughs> so you're, cal you're calming down a bit, aren't you? Yes. I'll walk around with him in a little bit. <laughs> Once he's done, I'll walk him around. Does he have a name? I have a name that I'm selling him. So usually oh, the ones yeah. I sell, I don't name. What's your name? Your big one. Chomp. 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 Yep, see, so see the very back of the top of his head, see right here? Right see there. right there, pet right there. Yeah, see? See, so what, what does his skin feel like? It's like rough, right? It's not like slimy or watery or anything, right? You're okay, bud. You're okay. Calm down. You're okay. Yep, I got it. Yeah, we're good. Calm down. It's you're okay, bud. You're okay. Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna walk around with him. That's what he uses to swim and everything when he goes through the water. And and these guys, these guys will get huge. I mean, 15 feet, these things will grow to, and just powerful, powerful. Even at this size, he puts a good 
he, he puts a good power into into his roles and his whip. So you just gotta let him know who's boss and everything's okay. okay. But he is definitely taming out. I think he just wants to get out and run around. And again, this is my buddy's Mark over at Jungle uh, Jungle Edge Exotics. And again, I'll put all his links in, in his description. But look at the eyes on that guy. They're just amazing, man. I'll tell you what, I love alligators. And I cannot wait to get one of my own. I like his tail. Oh yeah, I mean and that's that's cool. And I mean look at the size of this guy right he's here. I mean, we're probably he's two fifty. Two fifty? Oh see and that's I c I can't buy him yet. <laughs> it's a re it's a reasonable price though. Oh oh totally, yeah. He paid three fifty for his huge one. Wow. Just to catch me. Okay, okay. What are you doing to the poor pig? <laughs> Have a name? That's Remy and that's Riley. Remy? Okay. So I'm doing a little YouTube channel if you want to say something about her. So you said Remy? No. No? no? <laughs> Alright, so we, we have Remy here who's 11 weeks old. And Riley, she's three weeks. And then we have Riley, three weeks over there. And look at these little guys. Now look how quiet they're, he is. Why wasn't he quiet for me? They are <laughs> just she? full of life. Look at all that energy we got oh. here. He's not even hardly moving. <laughs> Nom, 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 get a nom, nom, of that face. Oh my god, look at that! Alright, so we met up with Mark. He's gonna introduce us to a couple of people. He's a big dog here in the Pennsylvania reptile game. Um, so let's see what we have going on, guys. So, alright, guys, so we're here with John, makes all these customs enclosures, and these things are awesome. You definitely gotta go uh, check him out, give him a follow, look at his stuff. Uh, look at this stuff here. This stuff is amazing. So if you are in the market to get some new enclosures, incubators, different things, uh, he's got some awesome stuff here. Uh, we're going to send him, I'll put all his links in the description and give him a minute to, to say what he's got going on. Right. Hey, how you guys doing? My name's John from John's Custom Creations. Pretty much do anything and everything short of making a unicorn. You got something in the mind that you need, whether it be a large enclosure for a monitor, down to a small enclosure for a little leopard gecko. Feel free to contact us at Facebook, John's Custom Creations. All right, guys, and like I said, I will I will put all his links in the description as well too. Um, and so I mean, and mostly pick up people come pick up and everything. Pick or, up delivery but, shipping. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and then I mean, how far like delivery wise? Or... Uh, delivery is seventy five cents a mile unless it's extended distances okay. and drops it. Yeah, yeah, seventy five cents a mile, man. You guys can't beat this, and especially I mean, you guys take a look at all these enclosures you got. I mean, these things are awesome here. Yeah. All right, guys, we're here with JH Reptiles. He's gonna just highlight a couple things real quick. He's got some amazing stuff here, and there's a huge selection. Uh, we're gonna give him a minute. Uh, he's, he's gonna pull something out for us, and then we're just going to uh, throw all his links and, and definitely go check out his page and check out his stuff because there is some amazing things here. Okay. So right here we have a Pias mucosis. It's an Asian rat snake that mimics a king cobra. Gets upwards of 10 foot. You can see, and look at that. That it's is awesome, colors. guys. Yeah, look at Extremely shiny. <laughs> this is a male. And that, and that's, look at that guy. And this is a giant Madagascar hog nose. Okay. Look at, look at the pattern and the color of that guy. That is amazing. This is a female. <laughs> All you spider guys out there, check this out. It's an Arizona blonde. They're pretty mellow. Can I? Will you get with them? All you do is gently nudge them. Yeah, just get a female. Guys, and I don't think I've ever held a tarantula before, so this is a first for me. But this guy is amazing. And how big will these guys get? Yeah, but so you see, Six inches. So they'll get pretty big, and I'm sure these guys eat everything, right? I mean, you uh, feed them. Mostly a bug eater. You, know, okay. you don't want to eat, feed them too many uh, pinky mice and stuff because it's too much protein. Okay. What kind of spider? Arizona blonde. I'll show you this. Is that what that is, Arizona blonde? Yeah.
unfortunately, we do have to get back <laughs> to to Baltimore. I have a big show tonight that I have to get to. But I will definitely be back with this area. They had some awesome stuff in there, man. Look at the toads and all the snakes and everything. And, and thanks so much, Mark, for taking us around and introducing us to all the people. Uh, it was definitely the beginning of a beautiful relationship. But uh, super excited to, to see more of those guys and to see what they have going on. Uh, but for now, we're gonna get back on the road, make the trek back to Baltimore. Let's go. guys quick detour pulling over here going to the bathroom grabbing a quick drink and a bite uh, we are on the road I hope you guys are enjoying that uh, but guess what I just hit check this out here I know crazy right 200,000 miles an hour and we're gonna push that as far as we can but uh, we're getting ready to get back on the road like I said quick stop Bathroom, bite, road, boom. Almost there, about an hour and a half left to get home. Of course, it's just a quick stop to grab all the stuff we need, and then we're heading down to, I think it's Glendale or something. Um, heading down to the country club down there to, to perform for those guys. We're gonna be doing some, some still walking, some juggling, some magic. Uh, I might even be able to bring you guys a glimpse of that mad, or of a, of a fire show. Um, stopping up, get some gas real quick, stretch the legs. Um, so man, it has been uh, three hours, and then I don't know, it's gonna be like five and a half hours in the car total today, and then like another. So, I mean, six or eight hours in the car total today, but I um, mean, it is worth it. We are building, we are moving, we, we are driving, and, and things have never been better in Sean Shenanigans and, and with SSSR. Uh, it's so awesome, and uh, we're just getting started back on the road. Finally made it home after I spent Lord knows how much money uh, on that turnpike because it was a new way I was going. It's supposed to be a little quicker. We will see what that bill looks like. But like I said, we are back home. Uh, we are loading up the car. As you can see, things are piling up quick. Um, we're down. We're down at the country club. Two 
tonight um, performing down there. Um, and maybe, maybe I'll see one of you guys out there. That would be awesome. Uh, you throw us a like, throw us a shout out. We are performing with three other people tonight and I will, I will throw all of their links in the description so you guys can check out their work as well. Um, you know, and then it's a quick turnaround, a couple hours of sleep, and then we are back up super early in the morning, heading over to White Marsh. We are balloon twisting uh, at, at the the Merit 5K Make a Wish, which is is awesome. I'm super excited uh, to to be with those guys and help out. Make a Wish it is an is an awesome, awesome organization, and and just. As I've been kind of delving in this world and doing more with the, with the vlogging and the filming and helping people, you know, and I saw some other YouTubers helping out and make a wish, and it's just a, an, an honor to be able to help that organization. And it's a very small too, very small piece of it, but you can better believe we're gonna grow and you know and just and do as much as we can for those guys and and just seeing how some of these big YouTubers are able to help and do things uh, for for these awesome kids. You know, and adults, I mean, it's awesome, and, and I just want to do as much as I can to help them out. Um, but I need to finish packing, guys. Uh, so go ahead and hang out. Uh, enjoy me filling up this car, watch this. And then I feel like a broken record over the last couple of days. We are back on the road again. Of stuff guys like can you believe that I had to speed the whole thing up just so we can get it in a decent amount of time um, but like I said broken record I'm getting back on the road but look at this this is just well one's a really big event super fancy and it's set and, and the balloon but just two events and look how much my car is packed and we can have all that just completely full packed to the brim let's hope this closes oh. And then we got all that in there packed up. I mean, table, chair, boom. Like, I got stilts. Oh, like, good to go. And then I even got stuff in the front seat. And then things are going to tomorrow. Tomorrow's vlog will be up a little later. Uh, just because I, I will not have time to edit it. You know, between tonight and tomorrow morning, it'll be up tomorrow afternoon. But don't worry, it will be there, and I'm not even gonna say it. I'm just going to spin you guys out. <sighs> guys, we have just arrived on location at the, I already forget it, Cat Cattail, Cattail Creek Country Club, I believe. Um, uh, so we are here, we're gonna unload our stuff, get everything in our green room, get to have things start going on, and uh, it's gonna be awesome. Let's go.
I'm gonna start getting things set up, warming up. We, uh, we got stilts. Uh, there's gonna be unicycle here, fire, juggling, magic, man, the whole gambit of, of what we have going on today. So it's going to be awesome. Thank you, Lauren, for having me. Uh, I can already feel the energy. It's gonna be awesome. I uh, will also put all the links for her stuff in the description. Give her a like and a follow. Now, as you guys can see, we got some new merch. We got a new shirt. Uh, those will be out soon for, for people to get keeping out for that. We are still wrapping up uh, a couple different logos and what shirt we want to go with and everything. But we will have those soon as well as uh, different colors and different things and stuff for the reptiles as well so definitely keep an eye out for that Taking a quick break a little backstage action for you guys uh, i'm just going to show you what a typical green room looks like uh, all right so here we go And we got clubs, we got fire staffs, stilts, unicycles, fire stuff, costumes, stilts, stuff everywhere. But this gig has been amazing. Like, 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 look at this. Like, just, I mean, like, where, where do you see this kind of stuff? Like, oh, but it feels good, man. All right, well, I'm getting ready to get back out there. Uh, why don't you guys enjoy a couple of quick picks from this evening? Come to the end of the night after our awesome gig. What is everyone's channel? Quego Mansa. Channel? On Instagram. Yeah, Facebook, whatever you want to. Uh, seven textures, Lauren Rouse. All right. And this guy? Julian. Julian hey. was awesome. He took care of us. Thank you. You'll be up yeah. on YouTube at Sean's oh, awesome. Shenanigans. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, what what an awesome gig. Who had fun tonight, guys? We all had fun. It was okay. Get out of here. I, 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 <laughs> what what an awesome End night. Like I, definitely End Lauren set this. <laughs> Mine's a little less grassy. I, I, I did. Oh, I changed I my I changed my shoes. Them. That polisher for your boots <laughs> is legit. Them. Look at these kicks. Look at these kicks. I think you gotta I mean you, you, you should have seen them you earlier. You should have seen them a little bit earlier. <laughs> Lauren set this all up. I will put her channel, all of her links in the description. Go check her out. Book her. It was an awesome gig. 
Uh, Absolutely. and we are getting back on the road again for Thank like my before. six hour in the car today to finally wrap it up my long trip all the way from Pittsburgh. Oh, so once again, let's get on the road. As I am finally home, I'm just gonna end it right here, guys. You're probably sick and tired of hearing me on the road again. Uh, I'm done saying on the road again. We're calling it a day. What an amazing day it was. It was so awesome. All the reptiles this morning. Sure, it was a long drive, but we flew by it. What an amazing gig tonight. Thank you, Lauren and Mufasa and Dave. We'll definitely be seeing more of those guys in the future. Uh, we got something special planned in, in Philly in August that, that we'll tell you guys about soon. Uh, I just can't go into detail about it yet. Um, and then definitely check out all the links, give them a like. It was, it was such a great event today, it was so awesome. But I am calling it a night, I need some sleep for sure. Uh, Cause I'm back up early again, like 6 a.m. tomorrow. But for another great calls, we are, we are balloon twisting at the Merit 5K um, for, for the Make-A-Wish Foundation. So, I mean, you, you can't ask for, for a better, um, you know, a, a better, a better gig a spot you know thing than that like that that is uh that is going to be an amazing event tomorrow and i'm super excited and, and i'll bring you guys you know f along as much as i can for that we'll definitely get some good pictures but i am shutting it down here i mean we are going on it's like a 17 hour day uh that that we've had today um so we are ending it here i'm done Poof, Puff the Magic Dragon. And thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, hit that share button, you know, hit that notification bell, you know, drop it in the comments. What do you guys want to see? You know, where do you guys want me to take you? I will try and make it happen. Uh, it's, you know, I love hearing from you guys and bringing you along. And just remember, you're worth it. You deserve it. You just gotta find a way to let yourself have it. Have a great night, guys.